Our training's going really good and our team's going to be real hard to beat. My biggest involvement so far has been getting the team selected. We had a lot of people show up this year for seven to represent the 1,200 of us. Make sure we have the right people with the right skills, the right PT, and the right attitudes to get the job done. Talk is cheap, and we'll look at the scoreboard afterward. In the words of Bart Scott, can't wait. We have 23 obstacles that are set up today. We have 20 physical obstacles and three mental obstacles. The mental obstacles consist of two Kim stations, one where the members will watch or view photographs, another one where they will write down what they saw in those photographs. They are spaced out amongst the course. Additionally, we have a weapons station where they are going to be putting together four weapons that have been taken apart, as well as the physical obstacles you can see behind me are the standard obstacles you would see on any Air Force or DOD uh, obstacle course. We're seeing top effort from each of the competitors today. They're putting forth mass, max effort, not knowing exactly what is going to be ahead of them at each step of the phase. The hardest one, uh, personally for me, was the last one where we had to climb up uh, three rows of, uh, of um, telephone poles and then the monkey bars, personally because uh, I don't really like heights that much, and uh, so that was the hardest for me. We've been training for about a month now, uh, doing two-day PT sessions in the morning and the afternoon. And then during the day we did uh, tactics training, uh, we did different uh, types of CQB, SUT, um, and just we were physically and mentally prepared. I feel great, uh, the team pushed hard all the way through, gave 110%. We were prepared and uh, I'm really impressed with our team.